Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Sam and I would love to have you guys subscribe so you won't miss out on any new videos. So today I am back doing a part two to my affordable perfumes video. The first one did really well and you guys seem to love my recommendations. So I'm here with part two with more fragrances for you guys. There's a freaking gnat. But anyways, without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Really quickly, I want to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor, and that is Dossier. I have been wanting to try out Dossier for so freaking long, and when they reached out to me, I was so excited. So Dossier actually makes affordable, high-quality perfumes that are supposed to be dupes for other designer perfumes. They start at $29, which is a pretty affordable price for me at least and i've been using their products and i love them so freaking much you can also do a return so if you're nervous about you know blind buying a fragrance and you're worried you might not like it they do offer returns so yeah i'll have my discount code along with the link in the description box so definitely check them out but let me go ahead and show you guys the fragrances that i got so the first one that I picked out was Gourmand White Flowers. This is kind of what the packaging looks like. It's super simple and sleek, which I love. I love packaging that is just simple. And this one is supposed to be a dupe for Victor and Roth Flower Balm, which I have actually smelled Flower Balm before, and it smells literally identical to this fragrance. Let me tell you guys. It is such a rich, expensive smelling perfume. This is one where I feel like the floral isn't too, too strong, but it has some sort of like warmth to it and depth to it that it kind of gives you like rich girl vibes. So I would totally wear this to like a girl's night out or a really nice date night and even just day to day. I think it would be fine too. But I love this fragrance because it seriously lasted so long on me. I have used these a few times and they last up to 8 hours honestly. So definitely pick them up. And I love that they actually have this like magnetic cap so you don't have to worry about the cap flying off. Yeah, this is the first one I have. And the other one I have is um, Floral Pink Pepper. So again, same bottle, same packaging, just a different fragrance. And this one is a dupe for Miss Dior. So let me tell you, I've been wanting Miss Dior for so freaking long. This is such a fresh floral fragrance. I love this scent. This is actually the one I'm wearing right now and it smells so rich. All these perfumes smell so expensive and so high quality. Like I would not assume that this is a $29 perfume. So I love this one. Again, out of the two, which one is my favorite? I would probably say, ugh, this is so hard. I'm going to say floral pink pepper, I think. I don't know. It's so hard to choose, but they come in these cute little boxes and Inside it says iconic scents, designer quality, no markup. So that is just the best. And it also comes with a little info card with the fragrance notes and what it's inspired by and the concentration. So yeah, this is the cute little note card they give you. So check out Dossier in the description box down below. Thank you so much to Dossier for sponsoring this portion of the video. The next fragrance I have here to share with you guys is one from Ariana Grande. I've been getting super into her fragrances. I only had one before, which was Cloud, and now I have Thank You Next. Look at how absolutely gorgeous this packaging is. I think this kind of packaging is one of my favorites. It comes out, and you have this little, like, holder, so I think that's so cute. This is a very sweet, like, a sweet tart fragrance. That's a tongue twister. It smells like sweet tarts and some people don't love her fragrances because it is a little more childlike But I love them so much the lasting power is great and I think that if you buy them Buy them from Walgreens because they're the cheapest there Ulta it's $45 but at Walgreens I got mine for $33 So pick this up. It smells super girly and if you just love that sweet like candy, I mean, I know she has one called sweet like candy, but if you love that like sweet candy like fragrance with a little bit of tartness in there, you would really love this. And the lasting power is pretty good. I would say seven hours is pretty decent for a perfume, but yeah, this is the one ounce and 
it's perfect for me because I have so many fragrances I do not need like a three ounce you know so this is one of the perfumes from Ariana Grande and I absolutely love her next perfume I have here is one from Urban Outfitters so I will just show you guys what this says it says acai bay I'm not sure <laughs> if that's how you pronounce it but this is a sweet fruity floral kind of fragrance i don't know the scent notes but again one ounce 18 fluid ounces these last like six hours so not too bad for an 18 dollar perfume there's a freaking gnat in here that will not leave but this scent is super good if you are going to work if you're just doing something casual during the day i think you can also bring this in the night with you so yeah this is another one i think the packaging is pretty cute and if you live by a urban outfitters or you shop at urban outfitters give their fragrances a chance they have a bunch of them they have fresh ones florals um gourmands so check them out another one that i have is from victoria's secret this is bombshell in bloom and i did pick this up during the semi-annual sale and i think it is so worth it i believe i paid about 17 dollars for this perfume and this one is 1.7 fluid ounces which is a really good deal victoria's secret perfumes typically cost about 58 dollars so definitely get them during the semi-annual sale this one is also a sweeter scent but it has this sweet fresh element it's so original like i've never had a perfume or fragrance that smells quite like this again super super girly if you love pink i just think this would be the fragrance for you if you are a girly girl and you just love that sweet you know candy fragrance this is another one that i think is perfect i mean look at this packaging it is absolutely to die for i love victoria's secret perfumes do they, they last the longest not as much i would say five six hours but i still think they are just such a beautiful fragrance and you can catch them on an amazing deal during the sale time so check them out i love this fragrance so much oh, i have been wearing this super often too so yeah next up is a perfume that i recently picked up as well these are all pretty recent pickups but this is um one from zara so this is what the packaging looks like it's very very simple i don't know if it's gonna freaking focus <laughs> It's not focusing, but it's a very, very simple packaging just with a purple cap. This is in Gardenia and it comes in a two pack for $13.90. So super, super affordable for those of you guys who want a cheap perfume that smells expensive. This is an exact dupe for YSL Black Opium. I think it smells seriously identical to Black Opium. It has that coffee note in there that just reminds me of black opium i swear it is a dupe if you guys have it please let me know pick this one up and tell me if you think it's a dupe because i seriously have smelled black opium a bajillion times and i think it is an exact dupe this is just super super good and it lasts a really long time it lasts all day for being seven dollars a piece i don't think you can go wrong like i really don't this does not smell cheap or anything like that it has those expensive fragrance notes in here that I think just smell beautifully and they work amazing on my body chemistry. The fragrance does not turn a weird fragrance or anything like that. It smells true to what it smells like out of the bottle and it lasts a really long time on your clothes. And another Zara perfume that came with that one, it was a two-pack. This is in Orchid, so hopefully this will try to focus here we go this one is an orchid so you can see it. you guys can see it's a very simple sort of packaging it's nothing crazy you're really just paying for what's inside of the bottle i feel like it smells so expensive like i feel like i really cracked the code with this video on like perfumes that are affordable that smell super expensive this is a fresh aquatic fragrance like that's all i can say it does say it has orchid in here but it reminds me a lot of aqua kiss by victoria's secret where it's aquatic and fresh but it also has that floral element in there again the lasting power is absolutely amazing i highly recommend you guys trying these i definitely want to try out more zara perfumes it lasts all day Ugh. this one has been one of my favorites so far um 
when I first got the set I was using gardenia a lot but now I just love this one I think it just smells so expensive and cologne -y in a way which I love those kinds of scents so yeah last perfume I have to share with you guys is another Ariana Grande perfume so this one is Ari by Ariana Grande it is like this kind of packaging where it has like a little crystal ball with a white poof and sometimes the white poof can get annoying because it gets in the way but other than that I think it just is a beautiful fragrance this is one of her more mature perfumes in my opinion because it has this creaminess where it's not super just like sweet like candy and you know sugary scent note I think Ari and um Cloud by Ariana Grande smell super mature because they kind of have more of a creamy musky fragrance to it this one is so good it just smells like a creamy cotton candy like scent but it has like a hint of musk which I feel like helps this fragrance last super long I've already gotten so freaking many compliments on this fragrance so I highly think it's worth it if I were to choose between this one and the thank you next perfume I personally would go ahead and pick this one up because I think this one smells just more mature and more I don't know what the word is like it just smells more mature and more womanly whereas this one does give me more like childlike vibes but I still love it don't get offended when I say childlike I love childlike fragrances so yeah but this one is amazing you can also find this at Walgreens so look online at the store locator or you can order it online I'm pretty sure so yeah don't pay anything more than $33 for this I picked this up at Ulta and I kind of regret it but I threw away my receipt so yeah this is Ari by Ariana Grande all right you guys so that is the end of this video i hope you guys enjoyed seeing all of the affordable perfumes that i have right now and big thank you to dossier again for sending me their perfume seriously they're amazing so please go check them out they have a bunch of different fragrance um fragrances to choose from so i'm sure you guys will find something that you guys love and will wear all the time but that is the end of today's video if you guys enjoyed it don't forget to comment like and subscribe and i'll see you in my next one bye uh, uh.